Hi, Psych2Goers, and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much. Your love and support has enabled us to bring you another twinkling wealth of everyday psychology. So let's explore. If you clicked on this video, chances are at some point in time, you wondered about your personality or maybe someone else's too. So how do you rank personalities? Did you know it has its own star for rating? But more on that later. Understanding the unique traits and characteristics of those around you can significantly enhance your communication skills and leadership as well, making you able to adapt in just about any social setting. Sounds like a pretty useful thing you should learn about, right? Well, behaviorist and HR specialist, Patrick Bet David certainly thought so, which is why he developed the STAR system, typology of personality. STAR stands for each of the four major personality types that David identified to help improve his employee hiring, training, and retention process. With that said, here are descriptions of the four different personality types and how to deal with them. Number one, structure-oriented. All hail the S of the STAR. Responsible, assertive, dutiful, dependable, and level-headed. These are all words you can use to describe a structure-oriented individual. And because you believe in the power of order, stability, and authority, you always make sure to lawfully uphold and abide by the set of rules in any given social institution. You are also very careful to act the way that you are expected to and may judge those who don't do the same. Your way of thinking is rational, objective, and pragmatic, an organized planner who loves to be on top of everything. Structure-oriented types often make for good leaders because they're so detail-oriented and self-motivated. However, this can also mean you tend to be rigid and inflexible about following the rules and don't usually like to compromise. If you know of someone like this, when communicating with them, it's best to present them with concrete facts and well thought out plans instead of trying to appeal to their emotional side. Number two, task oriented. The T of the star includes the creatives, the critical thinkers and the problem solvers of the world. Do you enjoy philosophical debates? Is brainstorming new ideas and insights your one true love? A true scholar and intellectual, task-oriented individuals have an insatiable curiosity to learn and understand the world, and they value knowledge and self-mastery above most else. You are highly insightful, introspective, and clever, always looking at the bigger picture, seeing possibilities others cannot. Your tendency to be imaginative, analytical, and eloquent turns you into visionaries and abstract thinkers. You dislike small talk, doing tedious, repetitive tasks, and just about anything that holds no substance for you. And despite what the name might lead you to believe, task-oriented people actually spend a lot of time getting lost in their own minds because of how rich and complex their inner world is. There is no greater joy in life than learning something new. Number three, action-oriented. Now, on to the A of the star which resides on the opposite side of the spectrum. Action-oriented personality types are more doers than thinkers. Are you a go-getter? Do you love to have fun and try new things? If so, that's because you crave excitement and adventure in your life. You value beauty, freedom, individuality, and above all else, making an impact in the world. Your true talent lies in improvising, storytelling, and entertaining others with your captivating presence. You have a passion for taking risks and getting things done. Even though you'd rather be a free spirit than taking charge of others, often leadership roles are thrust upon you in times of trouble. That is because your charisma helps you excel at handling crisis and bringing people together. Confident, adaptable, and resourceful, action-oriented leaders tend to be very pragmatic and encouraging, motivating others to do their best and recognizing them for a job well done. Four, relationship-oriented. The R of this star are social butterflies who value harmony and belongingness. Do you crave emotional connection and always want to be a part of something bigger than yourself? Empathetic, emotional, and idealistic, you are on a never-ending journey towards self-actualization and want to help others achieve the same. And so it makes sense that your talents often lie in diplomacy, mediating, inspiring, counseling, and mentoring. You are known for always putting other people's wants, needs, and feelings above your own. This is because you love supporting and taking care of your loved ones. So it comes as no surprise that you're very conflict adverse and often have difficulty both giving and receiving criticism, which may lead to a lack of healthy boundaries in your close relationships if you're not careful. But in the end, if you have a relationship-oriented person in your life, then you should count yourself very lucky indeed. 
because they're the best and most selfless kinds of friends you can ever make. Sweet. We hope we were able to give you insight into the different personality types. So, have you figured out your personality type yet? Which ones did you relate to the most? What category do you think your friends and family members belong to? Leave a comment down below about your experiences if you'd like. Please feel free to share any thoughts you have as well. If you found this video interesting, be sure to hit the like button and share it with those out there looking for the personality star. Don't forget to subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell for more new videos. And as always, thanks for watching.